Good morning guys. Today let's do the super star cutlet. Okay, let's do the super star cutlet. For this I have a half a kilo of mince. I have some crushed pepper. You just need two teaspoons of crushed pepper. Okay, mine is from Sudapur. Okay, from India. And I have a half an onion, finely chopped. When I say finely chopped, it should be finely chopped. A lime, one lime. Keep a backup of another line if you need to add, but just maybe add another half if you need. I have around five garlic flakes, chopped, finely chopped. Salt to taste. These are all my ingredients to make the beautiful superstar cutlet. So I added one and a half teaspoons of crushed pepper. I will add, say, one and maybe maybe a bit one and a quarter okay okay so the trick is sorry the trick is trick is you need to keep your egg okay the egg is the most important all right egg will give you you can bind everything together so egg is super super important right so mix all together okay you need to Put your chopped onions right all of them in and then all of this right all inside okay and then mix them all together very simple technique so let me run you through the ingredients one more time half a kilo of mince of whichever mince you like one egg to bind them all together a large half an onion from a large onion okay it should be half of it finely chopped four to five flakes of garlic, finely chopped, one and a half teaspoon of salt, or you can go less, okay, depends on your taste, and, sorry, one and a quarter teaspoon of salt, and one and a half teaspoon of crushed pepper, you can go less, but don't go more, okay, it will overpower, and that's all you need to put for this super star cutlet, don't put anything more than what I told you all right let's start to mix them all together all right so I've made my mixture mixed all together and I made one patty just to show you okay it will be around say three inches in diameter and try to make them as thin as possible all right because your cooking will be much more easier okay you can straight away shallow fry it on a pan with olive oil or you can use breadcrumbs, um, plain flour, and again an egg dip. So you start with your uh, egg dip, or you put your plain flour, egg dip, and then your crumbs, and then shallow fry. Simple technology, all right? Very, very easy. Try it at home. This is made specially. This video is dedicated to the community here all right cheers guys enjoy i'll fry and then i will show you how what we will do next so that's what i got finally and remember patience is the mother of all solutions so patience take your time and uh, the trick here is if people are following my video um, then you know i can tell you it is uh, three quarter kilo so we uh, I want people to watch and interact so therefore uh, we always keep something lighter all right and you can make smaller ones you can make heart shaped ones you know for children uh, like if you want to serve the young young uh, children you, you can give them smaller ones and you, you can you know uh, make a heart uh, which will you know keep everybody happy so let it rest in the fridge for say an hour yeah you need to make it you know so that it gets all bind together okay just for an hour all right so now you shallow fry them in olive oil you see i put the heart and there are different sizes so depends on how you like it and shallow fry them keep the top open and then you can turn it around all right so keep Turning it around, when you see it is almost there. Right? Very important. Now 
I'm the show now. Cut it.